manufacturing so interesting because we have the baby boomers, we have the Gen Xers, yep. we have the millennials, we have the Gen Zs. So we have like four different generations working in manufacturing together, which is just so interesting. Oh, because yeah. when you look at other industries like, um, you know, the, the 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 tech side of where we're at, like if it's social media or just <clears throat> big tech companies, um, you don't see a lot of boomer, you know, age set or super old on the older side of like gen gen the Xers working in that. It's a lot of millennials. It's a lot of Gen Zs in the industry, but manufacturing is unique in that, you know, in that circumstance. So like when I go out there and I create content or I'm, I'm trying to tell a story or or share something, I'm trying to make it to the point of leveraging what a younger what a younger mindset looks at, but can be very, um, I guess you could say, relatable to an older generation. And, cool. you know, like when I'm doing keynote presentations or when I'm speaking at events, you know, that's what I try and do. I try and celebrate the fact that, you know, we have different age groups. We have different ways of doing things. Um, and one way doesn't necessarily mean it's the best. But what we need to recognize is that everyone learns differently, everyone understands differently, and everyone communicates differently. 